hey we're filming at a different time of day we got a new chair we got more posters on the wall check it out more ats got some i got a lot of wall space over here that you can't see but i'm gonna put something there i promise um hi besties what's up <laughs> so i have some videos i've waited a little bit to watch this but what we are going to watch today right here right now is um stacy's asap mv so i um i don't know any other names but when stacy put out so bad somebody requested it in my comments of some video and i really liked it so when i saw that they had an upcoming comeback I put it in my notes and I said, when it comes out, we're gonna see it. So this is said comeback. And I think they did something really brilliant before I get into the music video. Is their like um, highlight medley for the album was just vocal tracks, like, um, like the opposite of MR removed. It was like no instrumentals, just one voice singing for each snippet, which is like a really brilliant way to give a teaser without kind of giving away too much of the song. Fascinating. Very cool marketing technique there. So, like I said, I don't know any of their names, except I know that the one with the deeper voice is the youngest. She's like 16. I'm obsessed with her. Let's let's get into it. Why am I still talking, huh? Also, I was in Walmart today, like two hours ago, and I'm not in anything super crazy. It's a pretty simple outfit for me, just a black skirt, pink shirt, and a denim jacket with some high heel black boots. And this lady, this total stranger, said that I looked stunningly gorgeous. She used those words and it was out of nowhere. And it was so nice and such a lovely compliment. And suddenly I feel stunningly gorgeous because I think I look really cute today. Ha <laughs> ha. Anyways. Okay. Stacy's ASAP in three, two, one, go. Ooh. I know nothing about what the song sounds like. I know I said I watched a preview, but I don't remember anything. This is giving me like updated. Oh yes. Hey. I love her. This pink is so cute. I'm obsessed with the timbre of her voice too. This is giving me like From Miss Nine and FX together. That hair, I'll explain later. See, this is cute, but like, not overdone. She's beautiful. Who is she? Ah! <laughs> oh, I like that dress. The glasses, bitch. Cute! I like, yes, hey, hey, hey. Hey! I really like this polka dotted skirt outfit. Hey! 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 I, okay, the, the fuzzy bucket hat's growing on me. Also, the blonde hair girl. Obsessed. Ah! I kind of hate the bangs, but it works on her. She's so cute! I can't, her makeup is so cute too. I love that. I like the mixing, like it's definitely Y2K fashion, but we got like 90s sprinkles in there too, so this is so on brand right now. This dance is so cute too. Hey, 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 Sam. I kind of love the like preschool looking necklaces coming back with the big chunky beads all just thrown on. I'm obsessed with her. Somebody tell me her name because she is beautiful. I like that. Yeah. I, I keep like not finishing my thought. I'm so sorry. Wait, are they two different people? I can't tell if she just changed outfits or if I've th been looking at the same girl or two different girls. Ah! Oh! I 
I love her voice. I can't get over it. Wait, where's the blonde girl? Was she wearing a wig or like... I'm confused. <laughs> Stacy fans, help me! Okay, wait a minute. Oh, shit. I was... Somebody's talking in the background. Sorry. Pause it here on the end. Figure out who is it that I was looking at. I think... I don't know. Somebody in the comments, please tell me who I was looking at. But, very cute. That's... And here's the thing. I say over and over, I don't do cute concepts. I don't like cute, but I don't I don't like cute forced on groups that are too old to be doing the concept or cute when it seems really strained or cute when it's like not organic. This is the kind of cute that I can go with. It's got that bright color, funky fashion, and it's not even like the things are like, okay, focus your thoughts to your page. It's just like, they're not trying to be like, they're just like being cute and like reacting with their faces and give an attitude. I think it's really cute. I love the whole sort of like, we've got kind of, kind of like a 2000s school motif, kind of just like a 2000s motif in general, but like a little bit of late 90s because um, all of these like bright flower decals and like I was saying, the like 90s and early 2000s is like really in vogue right now. And I think some groups don't quite get it right. I shouldn't say groups, stylists. I think this works. I don't think that these outfits are like, ooh, like too much. There's none that I looked at and I was like, oh, I hate it. Some of them I really liked. I really like, I don't know what her name is. The pink hair, the Tambay pink hair. She, her little um, green plaid outfit with the, the graphic tee underneath it, that's really cute. Whoever was wearing the like polka dotted skirt with the little sweat, like multicolored sweater top in the first like dance break section, I can't remember all the outfits, but I think they're really cute. The makeup is gorgeous. It's, it's a little bit more than like, oh, it's natural because they've got kind of like the pinky blush and then there was somebody that had pink and then blue on the outer corners, or maybe it was vice versa. Super cute. I just love like a kind of a smoke, almost like, it's not a smoky eye, it's like smoked out pink because it goes out farther than just the eye. It's so cute. It's so feminine. It's so 2000s. I love it. I didn't even talk about the song. I think the song is cute and catchy. I don't know if I love it as much as So Bad, but So Bad really came up and surprised me. But this is very cute. Very listenable, very much a repeatable song that I'm gonna end up listening to. I think the dance is cute and like the song, when it's cute without trying so hard, the dance follows that because the song isn't crazy like hard hitting or like crazy fast or anything. So the dance has an ease to it, which I appreciate because as much as I love like a very powerful choreography, I like that this isn't trying too hard. Like it's it's still complex and it has moves to it. I love the little like, the very much like the TikTok thing that's in now where you like pop your, your booty up on both sides. They're doing that subtly, which I think is really cute. I don't know, it just, it's, it's very effortless. And I like that because especially since they're a new group, you would think that they would be trying so hard and going way over the top to kind of impress people. But I think there's something different about them. I think they have this sort of innate star quality and I feel like they are gonna get popular pretty fast because they're just like doing their thing and showing themselves without being too blase and without too try hard. Um, I like that, I like that a lot. Now, I did not say in the beginning, but for you Stacy fans, when I was looking up that they were gonna have a comeback, I found this other video that I saved to watch for y'all. So, in addition to watching Stacy's ASAP, I don't know where I just looked, we are gonna watch Stacy's Like This performance version. From what I'm seeing here, this is one of the sets from So Bad, but I think they're in different outfits. I don't know what this sounds like. I just saved it once I saw that there was this to watch. So we're just gonna see what it's like. And it's a performance version, so I can watch the dance. And again, I won't know anybody who who anybody is. Dialing back, if anybody knows who that who the girl or girls that I was pointing out that I was obsessed with, drop the names or drop timestamps or help me. Help me. I want to know what the name is, but I feel like I'm not going to be able to tell them apart looking into pictures. I need your help. Help me out. Also, I'm 
not sponsored, but if Spindrift wants to sponsor me, I would love that because these are tasty, but they are expensive. I'll never see this, but <laughs> Stacy, like this performance version in three, two, one, shack hack. Oh, cute. I like it already. Oh, I like these outfits too. Oh! Not what I expected, but I like it. Hey. I like... I do love that as like their signature thing. Oh my god, the girl with the high pony. Work it, bitch. Hey, hey, hey. I love her skirt. Shut up. Yes, hey, hey. I love when they do wave formations in a V. Mm. I love that dress she has on too. And also blessed. They are dancing in sneakers. Thank you for saving their feet. Hey! Not crazy about her outfit, the strapless one. Hey! Yeah, that high ponytail is working it. I, I didn't mean to say it. I meant the hair itself, not just her, but like... Cute! Hey! Hey, hey! Yeah, I like. I'm obsessed with both of the rappers' voices. Hey! And her, like, half colored cardigan. Obsessed. Again, this is like they're hitting all the notes. Or not the notes, they're hitting all the beats but it doesn't feel forced and it doesn't feel lazy. It's just easy. Like they make it look easy, which is like a very much a good talented vibe in and of itself. Cause even choreography that's supposed to look easy, like it's not mega complicated, but they're making it look effortless. Is that, that's what I mean. I love hand choreography. Oh, there's like something so beautiful about it when they do that. I think it's because you can show a lot of attitude in just the way you tilt your head or you move your hands. It like makes or breaks a movement. And maybe that's why it looks so effortless because they're really using just a lot of they're accenting and doing their moves fully without having to put over overpowering it. Okay, I realized I just talked through the whole thing, but it's because I was enjoying it and I'm trying to figure out what are they doing that makes it work out so well. I don't know. I think that they, they like I said, they have some sort of different quality to them that I feel like I haven't seen in a girl group before and I really appreciate it. And this song is a little bit... A little bit cuter than So Bad, but again, not in a forced way or uncomfortable way. I really enjoyed that. I think probably I would more likely re-listen to ASAP more, but I would listen to Like This again and will listen again. Yeah, if there's things I need to know, but let me know because I'm still very much like, I don't know anything about this group, but I wanna learn because I, I'm liking what they're doing. I'm picking up what they're laying down, so. Leave that ish in the comments if you made it to the end. Thank you for watching. If you wanna leave a little subscribe, like, comment, that'd be cute. But you don't have to, it's up to you. But otherwise, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching, have a good day, have a good night, and happy Tuesday. <laughs> okay, see you later, bye!